Well, deliberations have begun in the trial of Amber Deloach. She was murdered last September. A Metro police then found her body in the trunk of a burning car in Yamacra Village. The 18-year-old had just graduated from Islands High School a few months before. 36-year-old Sean Sheely was charged with her murder based on surveillance video and forensic evidence. Well, that trial has been going on all week long. WJCL's Larry Spruill has been in the courtroom for the past two days, and he joins us now with the very late... That's right, Jennifer, and we have some updated news. Just happened about five minutes ago where the jury asked the judge to come back inside the courtroom to take another look at the surveillance video that happened that night. Now, both sides started their closing arguments today. Let's take a look at that video from earlier today. The district attorney's office started things off first around 10.30 a.m. They outlined the charges they were seeking to the jury and also talked about the bloodstains inside Sheely's apartment. The defense quickly bounced back, poking some holes at the prosecution case. They talked about the nature of Amber DeLoach, the night of her murder, and that Sheely did not rape her. They said the sex between the two was consensual. Also, the defense talked about the witness, Patrick George, who told the court Sheely told him that he killed DeLoach while they were both in jail. The defense said that witness was not credible and he could not he could be trying to strike a deal for a lesser prison sentence now the closing arguments wrapped up around around two o'clock earlier today and like i told you earlier jennifer the jury asked the judge for to, to come back inside the courtroom to take another look at the surveillance video so this could go on for a couple of more hours but we will have the more updated information on our website wjcl.com also i will stay here and while continue to cover this trial i have that information and this story tonight at 10 and 11. but for now reporting here live at the chatham county courthouse i'm larry spro for wjcl news working for you all right interesting thanks larry well a school counselor in